Hey guys, Matt Henderson here, checking in from Crate Insider. Uh, today we want to do a little tech video. Uh, a lot of times we crash, we wreck wheels, and you know, a lot of times you just scrap them, throw them away. So today we're actually going to show a Kaiser wheel that you take apart, you repair the, the bend or affected pieces. Uh, sometimes the outer edge like this one uh, a friend of mine wrecked with and destroyed is, you know, killed. I, probably as bad if not worse than I've ever seen. Sometimes we break the inside if a tie rod breaks and gets into the inner wheel. Either way, all these pieces are replaceable. So today, we're gonna take you through the steps of taking it apart, putting it back together to where it's, it's usable again. So as you can see, the extent of the damage, this wheel got folded up around so much that they actually had to take a sledgehammer and beat to where they could get the studs to get the wheel off the car. So, you know, it'll be a miracle really if we can get this apart without having to take a sawzall on it and physically cut the wheel in two uh, just to get to where we can take the ring apart from the inner shell. Okay, so to take a wheel apart from Kaiser, you need a 3 16 Allen wrench socket. You can do it manually, but it's a lot more work. A half inch wrench, a box cutter, and because of the damage, we may have to assist this one coming apart with a hammer. So let's get started. that we got from Kaiser. These keep, they keep these in stock here at Crate Insider. Now we're gonna piece it all back together, uh, seal it up and get it ready to go back on the racetrack. So now we put the inner shell against the outer shell, line them up, and then our unison ring here goes in and it has this dowel area to keep them lined up. Okay, so now we got our wheel back together, and the last step is you take and you re glue it with just some clear silicone and uh, just basically to seal it back up uh, from being apart. And I always clean the surface on the used side, whether it's the outer shell or the inner shell. Just clean it up, scrape the uh, previous glue off of it. That way you've got a clean mating surface and then it's ready to go back together. All right, and that's uh, that's our finished product here, replacing the outer shell of this Kaiser wheel. Um, saves the racer a boatload of money from having to replace the whole entire wheel. And you know, the way it is now, that's what you're looking for is the best way to race for less. So these are available at CrateInsider.com or you can stop by the storefront and uh, pick them up. Appreciate you guys checking us out. <music>